there, uh, YouTubers and subscribers and fans and whatever else. Um, I'm here announcing that there will be a casting call. Now, these are not first, like, you, what's it called again? First serve, first. Um, no, that will be secondary characters. That will be first serve. But that will come out later. Right now, these are the uh, main characters. These aren't the official defines, and the colors are right. I mean, the male's hair and everything. Uh, the hair is not going to be like that. Anyway, I'm just going to get started with this. And uh, this is Dark Claw. Dark Claw is the. All of these are main characters. They come out in every series almost. Um, he's a very, very major character. He's kind of like the, he's actually the main character. He's the one about the story. Um, Dark Claw needs a, um, very, it needs a very adult teenage male voice. Um, a very rough voice. So, yeah, uh, he has the attitude. And I need actors that can show emotion and everything but anyway this is fear fear is one of his friends fear doesn't last long he lasts like in four episodes i think uh fear needs a very uh teenage voice he's not serious serious all the time uh he's but i don't like need a very very young voice here uh so yeah i'm about to this is Lion Star, the leader of the clan, and Lion Star needs any type of voice. I don't really care about Lion Star. Any voice that sounds like a male voice. Um, yeah, but I don't want a very female-ish voice. I do want a voice with a little bit of like roughness, like you know, very not. I don't care, but at least it has kind of rough. You know. Now let's get on to darkness. Darkness is the one who possessed Dark Claw. Darkness needs a very, very deep voice. If you can do a voice that is deep, uh, that's okay. And if you have an accent, I don't. I guess this that will fit him. Fit him. So uh, a very deep voice. If you can make your voice really deep or at least deep. Yeah, so, uh, okay, now, this is Oscar, the last male character, he needs a very, uh, young, a very young voice, uh, uh, he's a dash hound, and you're like, what the heck is a dash hound, it's a winner dog, yay, <laughs> um, anyway, let's get on to the female characters, um, Caramel, Caramel has one eye missing, and the other eye is a robot eye, Caramel needs a very tomboyish um, voice, kind of like mine, but a little bit deeper, a little bit deeper, uh, yeah. So, she doesn't show much emotion, but yeah. Next time, Holly. Holly goes with fear and darkness. She's, she's the one doing all this too. Okay, Holly needs a very, hmm, let me call this, she lasts episode four and a half yeah four four two okay uh she needs like kind of a teenage voice female teenage voice um hmm, don't really recommend much about her so uh yeah there is a chance you can get her and then i think this is oh my god dang. Then Blood Pelt. She is a main main character too. She doesn't come up until episode five. Um, so Blood Pelt needs a very very kind of adult voice. You know. Um, hmm. Don't you need a deep voice? Uh, kind of need you to be yourself in this one. If you've seen Warriors. Um, uh, the series that Laura does, um, you can probably, Blue Star's voice is really good, um, if you can mimic that voice, or you can make it a little bit similar like that, I will, 
or you will fit for this character most and I think Robin Wing she's the last one she is the medicine cat she dies unfortunately and Holly Fear and her die the Holly Fear die in episode 4 and she dies later later on she needs a very soft sweet voice now I don't need a very like Oh, hey, I'm Robin Wayne. No, I kind of need a shy voice. She's very shy. So, uh, I guess that's the casting call. Yeah. So, uh, any characters you want to try out? There you go. And, uh, lines are in the description below. So, bye.